Hey guys, Iggy back again with Dragon Blogger. So here I have my Google Pixel XL. Actually, this is my wife's, though I do have the same phone. And she's been good to it so far, but I want to make sure that she takes care of it. So I got from my friends at Otterbox the Otter, Otterbox Defender case. Now, it also does come with a belt clip that also doubles as a stand, so maybe you could watch movies when you're not working, you're on your break, or something along those lines. But anyway, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to install this phone into this case. So first off, it's coated in rubber, all right, just to make it more durable. So to take it off, you're going to notice there's little seams right here. See that right here? Just pull that back, and you'll probably want to start over here on a corner. Just pull that back, and then you'll want to undo these little guys here, just to make sure it comes off easy, okay? And just peel it back. All right, that comes right off of there. That's the rubber piece. We don't need to worry about that right now. Now this part can be a little tiny bit challenging. All right, you'll notice right here and here and here, here, these little guys too, and then right up here. Those are all little clips that keep the phone compressed, everything nice in the case, all right, just to make sure that it doesn't break. All right, so what we're going to want to do is, first off, with your fingernail, for example, just fit, fit your fingernail right under here, and maybe use your other fingernail here to help you pry it open. All right, and you'll notice that just came open. Now, try to keep it a little bit opened up here, some pressure so that it doesn't snap back into place. So then undo this guy here. All right, we undid that one, and then we undo this clip here. Okay, and just again keeping it separated, lift this guy here, and then this guy, okay, so then after that the rest should come off relatively easy. Now the case doesn't bring uh, anything to wipe down with. So I do recommend having a piece of cloth nearby. So we're gonna go ahead and wipe the phone. Just make sure it's nice and clean. Now, we're just gonna go ahead and drop it right in here. Make sure the camera is right here. Camera aligns with here and the fingerprint reader aligns with this hole here. So now I'm just going to clean back there. You don't want to trap any dirt in there. Okay, and now just drop it in. You also don't want to trap any fingerprints or anything. Alright, so that's in there. It kind of just, I'm going to push it down, slides in there. Now that I put my greasy fingertips on it, now we just go ahead and clean it again. Okay, and then now we're going to go ahead and wipe this down. Again, this case does not come with this little wipe, so you will need to clean with something on your own that is clean and doesn't leave any lint behind. Okay, actually this side doesn't matter because this is the side your fingers are always going to touch anyway. So we clean the main part. Now we just slide it in and it's going to pretty much click into place. Alright, and there it's there, it's in. And now we're going to go ahead and put this back in. So we just slide it in down here. 
okay? And then we're going to want to make sure that everything clamps nice and uh, sealed just to protect all of the sides. So kind of just jam it in there right now. Okay, now that it's in there, basically, now you're going to want to make sure that everything is sealed here, so just pull it up. Just turn that off. Okay. Making sure everything is turned off already. <laughs> everything is nice and sealed. There we go. See how I'm just closing everything here? So just keep that up. <clears throat> now this isn't waterproof, but it definitely will help protect your phone to keep it as sealed as possible. For a waterproof case, you want to look at the LifeProof. It's a little bit more expensive, but it protects your investment. This guy does too, so, you know, simple things like just dropping your phone like that. Still on, because if it wasn't, my wife would kill me. And then, of course, if you like the belt clip or the holster, just click it right in there. All right, and this goes on your belt, and you're set. All right, so that's about it for now. Just installing the OtterBox Defender case onto the Google Pixel XL phone. <clears throat> so everything still works there. I don't know her code, so actually maybe I do. I do. Okay, so everything still works. Phone still works great. All right, so everything still works. Again, this is Iggy with Dragon Blogger doing a installation video for the OtterBox Defender case onto the Google Pixel XL. Iggy with Dragon Blogger out. See you guys.